We've just opened a brand new headquarters in Mount Pleasant. And so not only are we having our shareholder meeting, but we're also celebrating the grand opening of our headquarters. It's a big night. Have you seen our building? It's magnificent. I am so proud to be here in the heart of Mount Pleasant, serving six mile, the seven mile, and the Mount Pleasant community. You can feel the energy, people, we're excited. We put in our hard earned money, and we put our money where our mouth was. And it's a joining of hands with both the bank and this community. Banks for years gave money to people that didn't need loans. We give money to people that need loans. We share in their vision, and together we build their businesses, help their personal portfolios, and allow them to grow. You say to yourself, well, how do we keep engaged? I believe by allowing the organizations to come into this bank, use the conference room to have their monthly meetings, and have an office space is paramount. I don't think we can find a bank anywhere else in the state of South Carolina that has gone into a community and have done what we have done in the short of time that we have done it. Beacon Community Bank dedicates Grassroots Legacy Park to the six and seven mile community. My conception of a trust is really what holds the building together. And as long as the community can trust Beacon Bank, Beacon Bank can trust this community, it's my trust at all as well. Thank you. Just knowing Jefferson Freeman and Mrs. Lee, we've created a lasting friendship and we feel like we're part of their community. Banking is all about people. Like so many things in life, without a great team, you're nothing. That's been one of the greatest joys over the last six or so years is putting the team together. We've been really recruiting and hiring a lot of talented folks. Victor, because of his dedication and how he lives out Beacon, we brought him to the headquarters. We all work so well together and it's incredible to see how we're all working towards the success of the bank. What do we do next to say to this community, we actually mean business that we're here to share the dream not only for the bank board members, but the community. And I think that what we're doing now is sowing seeds. When you sow seeds, they eventually grow. If you'd have ever thought that after six years, it would be $630 million at this point, it was just phenomenal. In one year, it would be $750 million. And at the end of 2027, we will be a billion dollar bank. That's pretty cool. It's not your bank, it's not my bank, it's our bank.